is margaritas. Margarita. It's a margarita. Okay? Drum roll. <laughs> Y'all been waiting on this. Life update. <laughs> Well, pink is like neutral. Boys be wearing pink now, so. <laughs> this is 22. The box came with 30, though. So, if your kid have like a bigger class, it comes with 30. But I did 22 because that's how many I did last year. So, hopefully it's 22. And I told y'all he's taking his same little box we made last year. And I'm going to save it again. Hopefully he don't ruin it at school because it's going to get put right back up. Because I feel like I just did these with y'all. No, last year we did the cups. Me and Jazz did the cups. We like hot glued the stuff on there. Yeah, I feel like we just did that. I'm going to go to sleep. It's 12 o'clock. And I didn't even open up this vlog. Today is Tuesday. I didn't even open this vlog up. So, I don't know where this is going to go. <laughs> yeah. Bye, y'all. Hey y'all, happy Thursday. Today kicks off a new weekly vlog. If you're new here, my name is Poe. Don't forget to comment, like, share, and subscribe. Hey y'all, it's Thursday. Um, today is National Margarita Day. So yeah, we are partaking in that today when I go on break from work. Of course, I'm only probably going to do one or two because I got to come back to work, which I had a long break, so I I'll be good. I don't know if I want to go to... A lot of places is doing it, though. Glorious, Cyclone Anaya. Cyclone Anaya, I'm not going to even mess with them because I got to come back to work. And the way they margaritas hit. Chili's is doing it. Everybody. I really want to go to Dunleddy's, but... If y'all been to Dunleddy's, like, you can't go back to work after that either. They got some good good food that you got to go lay down afterwards. And they got some good margaritas. So I'm not going there. I'll probably just go to Chili's. Hand me some Southwest egg rolls. Two little, I think, mainly everybody, gonna, all their drinks going to be like $5. They're having $5 uh, margaritas. But yeah, y'all, I'm at work. It's early. I'm waiting on my 920. Yeah, and this is the weekend of, y'all going to get these life updates. Y'all ready? <laughs> I have been totally off my shit, y'all. But I have not been off. I've been recording. And I told y'all that I don't have a laptop. Sorry. I don't have a laptop. Um, I had I was uploading from a desktop at first, and then I was using Andrea's laptop. 
So, yeah, I have not uploaded a vlog since Portia's birthday, and I think Portia's birthday was in January, back the beginning of January. It's been about a month since I posted a video. Y'all been looking for me. Y'all done found me on Instagram. A lot of people in my DMs like, Paul, why you quit YouTube and why you quit? I did not quit, y'all. Life been life, and I told y'all I have a huge life update with, for y'all. So this is that vlog, so stay tuned. Huge life update, y'all. But yeah, um, I'm, I'm back. I'm coming back. I'm coming back. Um, I'll be settled, and life will be back like regular for me and... I have been vlogging. I just haven't been able to post. Then Andrea, who last time I used, you know Andrea, um, my friend, she um she moved further out, and I just don't be want to inconvenience people. Like I don't want to ask, keep asking for her laptop, then having to come meet her. And she does um uh, she works from home a lot too. She does like credit and Airbnb, and she be needing her laptop. I'm sure. I don't know if she have this desktop or not, but I know she be wanting her laptop. So I haven't been asking for it. So that's why I haven't been posting, y'all. So, I'm supposed to get a laptop this weekend. Cross our fingers. We get a laptop this weekend. I probably go. I'm available to go look on Sunday. So, we should be back, y'all. Fully back. I had some breakfast. I stopped at Jack in the Box. It's kind of watery now. This was earlier. I got me a good old, if y'all know, y'all know, a breakfast Jack from Jack in the Box. They used to be $0.99, cent, but I think the meal is still like $5, 5 or $6. I had that meal this morning with a caramel iced coffee. Yeah, yeah, I'm waiting on my 920, and then I should be off to go on break like about 2. I don't got to get the kids today. Their dad getting them, so I'm going to stop and go get me a few margaritas for Margarita Day. But yeah, yeah, I'm just opening up this week's vlog, and stay tuned. Bye, y'all. <laughs> Hey y'all, many, many hours later, after I told y'all today is National Margarita Day, I, um, my plans did not go as it was planned. I was supposed to go to work, I thought the kid's dad was going to get them, because he's been, like, getting them all week, like, I've been good, i just been able to, you know, go to work and do my own thing and whatever, but today he had to, like, work late so he couldn't get them on national margarita day on national margarita day but he can't get them which was fine i'm like okay cool so i had to get them drive them a distance and then drive back i finally made it back and then i end up i didn't go to chili's i end up going to los tios is it los tios it's los tios which if you, i do the vlogs before this y'all will see the vlogs i've been there and like they margaritas Y'all, if y'all have a Los Tios in your area, y'all better go. It's $5 margaritas from 3 to 7. And when I say it's authentic margaritas, it's not the watered down, like, uh-uh. Don't play with them. Don't play with them. Don't, baby, don't play with them. It's margaritas. Margarita. It's a margarita. Okay? It's a, <laughs> it's a margarita. The last time I went, the first, so I only been there twice, and I had the same bartender. It's a, a Hispanic chick, really cute, really nice. I had her. So when I went in today, it was packed, y'all. It was national. Y'all know today is National Margarita. It was so packed. So I ended up just taking my chances, went to the bar. I found a seat. So I had, like, it was a, a older white guy. Excuse me. A older white guy that sat down maybe... I sat down first, and he sat down maybe 10 minutes after me, next to me, because we didn't know if the seats was taken or not, but the other guy that told me, he said, yeah, you can sit down, it's cool, I'm leaving, it's whatever. I sat down, then the older white guy, probably 15 minutes after me. So I sat there, just waited. I know it was busy. Like, y'all know me. I'm a person that's always going to show grace, show grace, show grace to fast food workers, servers, all that. I've been a server before I worked at IHOP. I never ever told y'all that. I worked at IHOP, and I worked at AMC 30, so I know how, you know, I never worked at fast food, so I don't know how that goes, but I know that they get, like, the, 
they get the shit in the stick too. So I know how that works. So I'm always gracious wherever I go. Like I'm always, you know. So um, I get them grace. So the uh the guy, the bartender guy, which I always get the girl. She had already recognized me. She was like, hey, cause I I've been over there two times before that, but she was wasn't on that side. I think they had sides. She was on that side, and the guy was on this side, which I never seen her have a partner. It was that's how. Why is it blurry? Okay. That's how busy it was, y'all. So, um, she had that side, and he had that side. I never saw him. But he came over here, you know, introduced himself. He says, busy, this and that. I'll be right back. I'm like, cool. So, a manager lady here came over there. So, I'm thinking she about to, you know, she she was over there to help. She didn't look at me, y'all. She didn't look at me, y'all. She didn't even look at me. She looked at the guy next to me which was a white older man asked him what he wanted to drink asked him what he wanted to eat all that didn't didn't even look at me so i'm like maybe she gonna take his order which is cool we it's just like 15 minutes off i came before him but it's 15 minutes off cool um he ordered his food did not come back to me didn't say nothing Didn't say nothing. But the guy had eventually coming back. He came back, and I'm like, all I want is, like, a margarita, a regular margarita. He's like, the Grand Gold's are on sale for $6. You can get a Grand Gold. He was really nice, y'all. He was so damn nice. I got the Grand Gold, and he was like, just look at me and, like, give me eye contact so I know when you're ready to order. So I gave him eye contact when I was ready to order, ordered my food. I had got some enchiladas, like a, a combination of enchiladas. Ordered my food, food came out. He brought the food from the back. He came out, he said, hot, plate is hot. Put my dish in front of me. Damn, they put my napkin in my lap. Like, really, really good guy. Like, but the manager, like, I kind of feel like I should have got her, her name and complaint. Like, the way she, like, didn't even come back over there and ask this guy that. Anyways. But I just, he just kept saying, like, it's just, I'm like, I see how busy it is, sir. You good. It's okay. I'm not one of those. Like, you okay. Like, and I don't even feel like he was moving that slow. For the, what I'm looking at, you good. Then some other white guy come over there telling me about his wife's tequila business. And I can't even remember. It's called a casa or something like that. I probably should have recorded it. But I did not record on my phone. I mean, on my camera, y'all. Because it was so busy and it was so loud. I got a little footage on my of, on my phone of the drink and the food. That was it. I couldn't get, like, footage on my camera. Because I would have feel like they would have been. It, like, I was on Buffalo Speedway. Full of, like, it's a white area. I'm sorry. It's a white area. And they would have been looking at me crazy. It was just so busy in there. It's National Margarita Day. Like, it was just so busy. But I got my margaritas. I'm about to go in the house, take me a bath. And tomorrow is Friday, and we'll pick the camera back up tomorrow. So, have a good night, y'all. I just wanted to tell y'all about my night because I didn't. It's going to be like a gap of me picking up the camera, but I'm trying to get more active without telling y'all about my days and ending our vlogs because, yeah, I hate when people don't end up their vlogs. So, bye, y'all. Have a good night. See y'all tomorrow. Hey, y'all. Happy Friday. Um, I just pulled back up to work. I've been came this morning i had a 9 20 i left and i came back now because i have some afternoon appointments do not mind that back seat do not mind this hair it is hot outside y'all it's 77 degrees this morning i think it was 45 or 50 like it's so damn hot houston is crazy houston is crazy yesterday it was like 81 it was hot and it was like 35 in the morning you don't know what to put your kids on. I don't be knowing what to put on Eli. Because by the time I put him on some jeans or some sweats, he's going to go outside. He's going to be hot as hell for recess. But, yeah, y'all, I'm not doing much today. Um, After I get off, I'm probably going to go home, take a bath, relax. And then um, I'm going to watch Tyler Perry and Kelly. And him. Kelly has a movie. It's Tyler Perry movie, but Kelly's in it. Um, it's called Mia Copeland or something like that on Netflix. I'm going to watch that tonight. It looks really good. They've been talking about it and stuff. It was so funny. I saw on Twitter that, because uh, Kelly, they've been showing scenes, and Kelly hair is always late. It was late. So they was like, Kelly probably told Tyler Perry, uh-uh, I'm 
bringing my own wigs. <laughs> Cause y'all know Tyler Perry will throw you on some shit. Y'all seen Diary Man Black Woman and Braids he had on Shamar Shamar and how them wigs he be putting on people. They was like Kelly probably told his ass, uh uh, I bring my own wigs. Cause Tyler, I don't know who in that wig department, but they don't be giving a damn. But yeah, y'all, not doing much today, so I'm probably not gonna pick up the camera again. Have y'all been watching Love is Blind? Please comment below if y'all been watching Love is Blind season six this season. That damn Ken pissed me off last night. First of all, I didn't know that, that the new episodes drop on Wednesdays. I thought they dropped on Fridays, so I'm just sitting here waiting, and then I see people talking about it. I'm like, how are y'all watching the new episodes? And they're like, so I look, and they come on Wednesdays. So I've been waiting till Friday, so I watched yesterday. That Ken... I don't know if y'all watched it already, but that damn Ken with his hips, his hippie ass, he had the nerve to do Britney like that. If y'all ain't watched it, fast forward this part. To do Britney like that. She is so beautiful. And it was like he was all into her until they got home and he got his phone. When he got his phone, he just turned to, and he, when she was trying to express herself last night and tell him, like, you haven't kissed me. You haven't, um, if y'all hear it like that, no, it's, that's the AC, it's hot. Um, you haven't kissed me, you haven't shown no affection, and he was just like, well, we're not gonna work out if you think, like, because it one day that I'm not affectionate, that it's a problem or something like that. He just, like, got real sassy. Him and them hips got real sassy. And he got on his, she, she just started breaking down. She was crying. He didn't show her no affection. He didn't go give her a hug. He set those hips right in that chair across from her and stayed in that seat. And then had the nerve to get on his phone. He got on his phone. I said this. Y'all remember the uh, show Girlfriends when Joan had uh, that dude. And I think she went in his room she ended up finding those spanks. Because he had hips. He was like, I have big hips, Joan, or something like that. He had those hips. That's what can't can give me. Like, the nerve of you. The the, the nerve. Yeah, he, he really, and AD, and I think Corey, they ain't going to make it. I think it's going to be one couple that make it. Because one of them, the other dude, he was cheating. He, he stayed out till 6 o'clock in the morning, and she found out he slept with somebody. So, it's only one couple that I think I'm making. That's the, uh, I think she's, like, a Hispanic or Puerto Rican girl, and a white guy with the, like, I can't remember their names. I don't know why, but them two gonna make it. He got, like, that reddish blonde hair. Them two gonna make it. That's it. That's from this season. That's all I got. One couple. That's it. AD and Corey might make it to the altar, but... He gonna pull some shit when they get to the altar and be like, um, I'm not ready for a relationship, but I still want to be with you. I still want to date. You know how they do most of them when they get to altar. I still want to date you, but I'm not ready for marriage. Which, why the fuck did you come on the show if you wasn't ready for marriage? This is like Love is Blind. You get married immediately once y'all meet. You propose. But he gonna pull something like that. I believe he is. But yeah, y'all. I'm not doing much today. I'm about to go finish working, go home, take a bath, watch some shows. Might stop and give me some wine. I don't know. Uh, clients early tomorrow and yeah i probably talk to you tomorrow i might pick the camera back up and we'll discuss the mia copa movie especially if it's not good because they it looks good but we'll see we shall see talk to y'all later y'all happy friday hey y'all happy saturday i just got off of work i had a i only had one i only took one appointment one appointment today i took a 11 20 because Drum roll. <laughs> Y'all been waiting on this. Life update. We have moved, y'all. <laughs> Stuff is everywhere. Stuff is everywhere. The movers came. They, they just put everything in here because I was at work. We're not movers. People I know. But yeah, y'all. We moved. I'll show y'all more once I put stuff up and get stuff settled. But yeah. Life update. I'll get more in depth tomorrow because I got a lot of stuff to do today, so I can't just really, you know, get in depth with it. But, uh, yeah, we moved. We no longer live in the house. I live in a new apartment. Um, I'm single. Single, single, single. I've been single for a while, y'all. I don't know if y'all didn't notice, but I haven't, like, 
Y'all haven't seen Jake. Y'all haven't really... Which I really never... Even when I was in a relationship, I always said I wanted my vlog to be my vlog. This is not a relationship vlog. So I really never post him, but I did say, you know, Jake's home. Jake's, we're going somewhere. We're about to go here, but y'all notice they kind of slow down. I don't know if y'all pick, pick that up, but yeah. I moved out. He moved out. The house was a rented house, so it wasn't like we had tied to, like, it was ours or whatever. It was a rented house. We had been there, I think, three years, about to be four. But yeah, y'all, I'm still in the same area, which is better because I'm closer to Erin's school, which is like walking distance, y'all. Y'all know she goes to a different school out of the district, so she rides the bus to her original school. And y'all know I'll be having to go rush and pick up if I got something to do around that time. I can't do it because I got to pick her up or her daddy would get her. But she can walk now, y'all. We are so close to her school. She can walk. I ain't going to worry about rushing. Y'all know Eli's in daycare until like 6. He could stay until 6.30, which I was picking up early anyway. But I don't have to rush no more. But yeah, y'all. Just a life update that y'all been waiting on. I'll get more in that tomorrow. Um, I got to put up all this shit. It's stuff everywhere. But yeah, I moved today. My stuff have been in storage. It was supposed to be two weeks, y'all. So the apartment, this apartment that I wanted, they didn't have these cabinets. The cabinets were like brown, like they did a whole. That's the ice thing. Don't start that shit. <laughs> y'all know I ain't been alone. Don't start that shit. Anyways, um, the cabinets were like a brown ugly ugly color i paid for the upgrade i wanted this apartment to be i wanted these cabinets these are the ones they showed me but it was on the third floor i was like no absolutely not you know how eli is he don't even like to walk in the morning i'm not carrying him down three flights of stairs so she was like we have to wait another week we will do the cabinets they did the cabinets in the here the cabinets in the bathrooms um the rooms they had to replace all this stuff so i said i'll wait another week to be on the second floor and what I want. So I waited. So it's been three weeks, y'all. If y'all notice, I have not posted a vlog or nothing. But I have been vlogging. I vlog Valentine's Day and then it's a pile of so it's gonna be two vlogs for this huge life life update. But I've been vlogging. And then another reason y'all I haven't been able to post because y'all yeah, know I don't have a laptop. I've been using Andrea's laptop. She moved into a new house, which is further from me. And I don't want to in inconvenience her. She uses her laptop. She works on her laptop. Like, I you know she does credit. She has an Airbnb. She uses it. So, I don't want to in inconvenience nobody. So, hopefully tomorrow, because if I have time today, I'll go look today. We're going to go find a MacBook. I got to get back to posting. Like, shout out to all y'all that's been checking on me. Like, y'all been writing me in my DMs. I up uploaded a short on Valentine's Day. And all y'all like, where you been? Like, what's up? Did you quit YouTube? No, I haven't quit. I have been vlogging. I just had no way to post. I got so much footage on this camera. Footage on the footage on this camera to post. Like, I'm back, y'all. I'm back. Once I get settled in here, but right now, I'm about to go to this furniture place because only thing I kept was the kids' bed. Everything else, I want new. New, new, new year, new me. No, no, we ain't bringing nothing from the last. Nah, take all that, leave it or whatever. Everything on this. So I need a couch, and I need a bed for my room, and maybe a dining table. I'm not too worried about a dining table. This area is not really that big, but I do want a dining table. But I'm not really worried about that. I'm worried about getting a couch and a bedroom set for my room. The kids' room is still the same. We just got that. Um, maybe last year, all this stuff that came from my kid. That's that's fine. But yeah, y'all, and I did take my two chairs that's, if you ever saw my, like, dining area when you first walk in the house, I got those two chairs, and I probably match it with, like, a sectional or something and put another one of those chairs in my room. So, yeah, y'all, we finna decorate. We finna get it together here. I'm so ready for this. Like, we gonna decorate together. I'm gonna show y'all. So, yeah, this is the new journey, y'all. Single pole. Summertime is coming up. Summertime is coming up. We about to be out here. Like, we ain't just about to be like, you know, we ain't gonna be no hoe and do all that. But we finna get out here and experience some things, go on some dates. Like, <laughs> you done fucked up, right? You know you done fucked up, right? <laughs> but I'm about to go to this furniture store. I think I'm gonna take y'all with me. But yeah, happy Saturday, y'all. Happy life update. And I'm ready to go on this journey with y'all.
I'm here at the furniture store, y'all, and I think I picked three pieces out. This is nice, but it's really expensive. It's really pretty. So either between this table or this higher one uh, right here, I sent this to my friends. I really like this little circle one. It's kind of low, and they didn't like the chairs, but I like it. I think it's like modern. They didn't like it, so I went with this one. On with this one and then I got this bed y'all it's so cute and dark and I'm about to show y'all the couch and everything's getting delivered today I also like these couches I love but I never used to be into sectionals y'all like my last apartment I had by myself it was definitely double couches I love this this looks so comfortable like look how thick this is so cute. Let me show you the couch I got. This is the couch I end up getting, y'all. I think we're gonna do gray. Grays and blues. Never did those colors, but yeah. That's what we're gonna do. Cute. Whew. Hey, y'all. Many, many hours later. I'm all fucking tired. I filmed on my phone, went to the uh, furniture store. I did, we got a bed. I think I showed y'all everything. I'm gonna insert the clips in for my phone. The bed, the dining table, which I'm at right now, and the couch. This is Instagram versus reality. <laughs> versus reality. And you would think I ain't touched nothing, but I have. I've been in the kitchen unboxing boxes in the bedroom, um, my bathroom, Erin in the bathroom. Erin's getting her hair braided, so she have not helped with nothing. I had to come here, let them in, uh, take Erin. This girl, this a, I think she's in high school. It's a girl up the street. She, she braids hair at home. I've been following her for a little while, and my... Um, niece ended up telling me that she knew her so I was like okay I'm gonna take Erin to her because Erin wanted six braids and some star thing on the side of her hair so the girl said she could do it today so I took her there then I came back here they were done they were done by the time I got back done so yeah I'm tired I want to take a bath I'm supposed to go out with uh, Maisha and Jazz I think they going to Uptown. We was just going to go to Nameless and just have some hookah and chill. But Maisha said her husband is getting a section at Uptown. So I don't know, y'all. I'm tired. I kind of just want to finish unpacking a little bit more, take a bath, and just chill. But I don't know. I'm tired. Then again, I do want to get out because I ain't did nothing. I haven't been doing shit. I know I'm tired. <laughs> I want to take a bath. It's been hot today. It's been in the 80s. Good God. I think I'm going to go, though. Let's have a drink or two, um, smoke some hookah, and then come back home. We shall see. But, yeah. Just updating, y'all. I probably can. Aaron should be done in a, a little bit. It's 6.54. I took her at 4.15. So, that girl probably was like, because... And then uh, I'm like, um, how many bags of hair? Because it doesn't say on her page. How many bags of hair does she need? She was like, one. I'm like, okay, cool. I'm going to stop by the uh, beauty supply store. And she was like, and you need to bring edge control. You got to provide my own edge control? I said, Erin, when you're done, you better take the edge control with you. Because the hell? Anyways, that's new for me, bringing your own edge control. When you get your hair braided. Never heard of that. But anyways... I just put a wait on Aaron, get Aaron, and then I'll let y'all know what I do if I decide to go out or not. Hey, y'all. I'm back from getting Aaron. Oh, my God. I'm not going to go home. I am going out. And I have two possible places to go. My Aisha husband's getting a section, and my cousins are in town. Most of my cousins, they work offshore. They're in town, and they want to go to, um, 
No, Mad Midtown. They got a section, but I, I'm not going nowhere. I'm tired. And then if I go to I'm going to wake up late. I'm not going to want to come back and get this house together. Then I'm, I'm going to brunch tomorrow at uh, sunrise. So I'll just... No, I ain't going nowhere tonight. Take me a bath, chill. And I want to watch that new... um That movie Kelly's in. Mia Copet. So I'm, I'm going to watch that. So, yeah. It's not happening. I'm tired. And once I take a bath, yeah, nah. So yeah, yeah. Come, let me see your hair. So I got your hair. It's really cute. She did a good job. I tipped her. She did a really good job. I have to go let her do mine. Let me see your hair. Hey, she got a little star. I didn't think the star was gonna be cute, but it's cute. Let me see you the back and stuff. Six braids, it's pretty cute. People get their hair done and do not know how to act. No, I don't. <laughs> but yeah, yeah, I'm about to call it a night. I will talk to y'all tomorrow. I get more of this stuff put away. I need to get these TVs mounted. Yeah. Bye, y'all. Good night. Hey, y'all. Happy Saturday. Uh, I woke up this morning. I went to the mall. I was really looking for, like, a like a sundress. So it's hot as hell outside. It's, um, how many degrees is it outside? It's 80. It's hot. It's real hot. It's kind of like a little breeze, but it's hot. So I was looking for, like, a sundress, no sleeves, throwing some sandals. Then I had to think about my feet. I can't tell you the last time I had a pedicure. So, yeah. Because it's been caught. Well, I still get my... I'm not one of those girls. Just, just don't, let me stop y'all. Because I know y'all be talking about it on here. People that stop getting a pedicure during the winter. I don't get them as much. But I get them. But I don't get them as much. And I've been real busy. So, I haven't got a pedicure in a while. And Tina's going to be so pissed when she sees these feet. And these, the heel of these feet. Because, baby. She going to have to get... The Myra Drill Light form. But, um, I couldn't do that. So, no sundress. At least not a long one. And all they had was long ones. Because, uh, like, when it comes to, like, my knee, a little shorter, I, I throw some tennis shoes with that. But the one I bought was long. So, I'm not going to wear that. So, I ended up doing on this white top I got from there. Cute little top. I think it was, like, $7. And it's, um, I'm going to show y'all. Because it's a full-length mirror in this bathroom, y'all. Y'all gonna get like more outfit of the days. Um, it's a full mirror here. So I got on this brown skirt and then I put on my brown ducks. So yeah. And I threw on jewelry wise LV earrings, some LV bracelets. So it's just like a you know, neutral Gucci head, neutral day.
trying to make it look brighter, but it's like this and stuff. Oh shit, it smells just as good as that one, but a little bit more intense. Oh, that smells good. Damn! That that smells good. But I ain't doubt it because this one smells good. I only got they don't have nothing on top of this one, but they got Prada and Tint. And also get these bottles engraved. I remember we went to Dubai. Um, one of the girls we went with, she bought her some when it first came out, and they had it in the airport, and she got her, her name engraved on it. In uh Sephora, I didn't know Sephora did that until then. But yeah, yeah, I'm about to head out. I'm gonna have to buy another perfume rack because the little flat one I got, it don't fit this count. This kind of kind of small in here. See, it's not fitting those perfumes and I still have that rack but it's not fitting those but yeah y'all let's head out let me find some lip gloss and I'll pick that back up Yeah. <laughs> 
10 out of 10. And this corn, and I don't even like corn, but this, these are good. Ooh. Good. <laughs> Trying my Isha red velvet waffle. You <laughs> say it's good. That's good. That's like a. I'm not even big on cream cheese stuff. That's like a cream cheese. That's good. That's a good real good They didn't give me no cilantro. Excuse me. The cilantro and the onion. I didn't get any. I'm sorry? Cilantro and the onion. You want cilantro and onion? Yeah. Okay. Thank you. No, I want it. No. <laughs> I don't want it. I want what's supposed to be on this plate. And there wasn't nothing on here. They literally put, they must have forgot. They put like four pieces of red onion on there. Like, you want the full effect, baby, of the burrito taco. It must be an experience. Yes. <laughs> Look at her. She all for it. This is a food. <laughs> you think I eat a lot? I like food. <laughs> DoorDash guy. This is doing honey. They, like, if they had like a gold status, she would probably be platinum. <laughs> Not even gold, platinum. Why am I doing some of this thing? That's crazy. Yes. Let me put my uh, card gonna... back up because um, pack Mr. Martinez has come to the tab. Yeah, Mr. Martinez. Mrs. Martinez was not going to <laughs> My cousin, y'all should have said his name. Oh, yes, Love please. that for me. Shout out to Martinez. Shout out to Mr. <laughs> Martinez. Mr. Martinez. And guess what? We lashes. We you wear 25, artists. what? M.M. Oh, oh, 25. Yeah. 25 is a lot. He's telling us how he's a baddie. I already saw the baddie in him. I saw it through. I saw it. I already <laughs> saw it. You just was busy, but I was like, like I'm this to this you, baddie. So outside of work, I do my makeup, and then That's just wait shit. because whenever I get into my zone and my prime, I'm a Libra, so whenever I'm popping, oh. I'm popping, popping. Oh. And popping, popping, popping. 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 I used to do 32. I'm a little older now, so I didn't cut back. I got one question. You don't have to shoot to be on the show. Wait. But if you have to shoot. Um, I don't I don't care like that. Doja Cat. Doja Cat. Okay. okay. I like Doja. Yeah. I can do she Doja. Moves so sexy. I can do Doja. She moves so sexy. I like Doja. Like, to me, I understand why people get into Beyonce, Nicki Minaj, Cardi B, because yeah. to me, music is like about the way that it makes you feel. Yes, amen. And so Doja Cat really but Doja makes me is feel like, uh, something. She a different level. Because the way that she Doja does her, different. like, dances like yeah. that, like... I can get into it. I love see, it. See, you seen so that? She's all around, work. though. That was like work. I, I'm seeing you. I'm knowing. I'm, you. I'm knowing. And my little pictures, my pictures on my Instagram are from Doja Cat's concert. Oh, is that so your you like? Is that your Insta or your Finsta? Because it's, it's getting Finsta. No, uh, it's because I had my Instagram with my like the followers and everything, mm. but I have old people like from and you know what childhood.
see for you too. Yeah, yeah, but I'm with the G. Then I'm sitting inside and leave. Yeah, I'm eating the How about having another?